I mean, look at that massive ring, though. That massive donut-shaped ring. I wonder if I can travel on it. Probably a bad idea to just check it out, because there might be some strong monsters, which I don't even know if there are, if there are any, but I just want to see. Also, let me go find a, um, a data, a data probe so that I can install it and expand the map. The map's visibility, I should say. I have fun that they have, like, spiny, um, spikes things on them, but you don't take damage. Oh, well. Alright. Hopefully the data probe is somewhere around here. I gotta watch out not, by not falling unless the data probe is right there. I have a feeling it might be up there, but I really don't know. Yikes, 31. Barbarich Desert. Yeah, I don't want to fight those monsters here. Well, that is one massive beast over there. Gotta watch out. That was 39. Well, that was this monster. Level 55. Yikes! Level 32. Uh oh. Tatsu is annoying. Wow, that mirror is post. Doesn't seem like I can climb it. Oh well. Oh, whatever. I'll check out, you know. I'll explore more around um, Oblivia another time, should it the game require me to do so. Started this game, killed about 300 shadows to get toward a level 9. I wanted 10, but got bored. Really now? Huh. Alright. Let's go to our actual destination. Besides, it's pretty important to just, you know, see what's going on over here and why, you know, this is important. Uh, I don't know if I could fight them, but whatever. Oh yeah, this ring is... is traversable. Or whatever the word is. Leaning ring. Yeah, we can walk on it. Cool. Level 24. Hmm, I don't know if I should fight it, though. All before you leave the first world. Traverse Town? Right. Okay. Well, this is not important right now. Let's actually get to the destination. I've been being, I'm being sidetracked with all this exploration and goodies and this monster fighting. Like this game, it has so much to do that you're just sidetracked from everything you want to check out. Oh my god, this massive beast though. Not oh, Traverse Destiny. Oh, okay. Alright, there you are. Ooh, you are with those monsters. Okay. Well, they won't attack. You guys really saved our bacon. Now we can finally get back to work. You have our thanks, and I'm sure Laos as well. Don't mention it. We're just doing our job, same as you. Do you guys have any idea where Lao is? Or why he just up and left like that? No idea. And even less of an idea when he'll return. I'm sure he's just giving us a chance to grow. Sure he is. Sure he is. What? Don't give me that look. I still trust him. Mostly. Hey, I'd be pretty upset if someone forgot to restock and then left me stranded. Actually, that was our mistake, not his. He just left us dead weights behind while he finished the job. He's always been like that, actually. Always? Wait, you must be... Sidon, ma'am. I've been working with Lao since we were back on Earth. Truth be told, 
He's the only reason I ever made it into Project Exodus. Without his recommendation, I'd be long dead. Me and Mondo worked on the Frontier Nav development team. Needless to say, we've been big fans of Laos ever since. Oh, I'm Shingo, by the way. And that there is Mondo. I had no idea you guys had such respect for Lao. I'm sorry if it sounded like I was bad-mouthing him. Anyway, are you all set here now? Oh, we should be fine. Except... I'm not glad so bad. Your tower at platform took me well, three tries on a camera where I had once in Acro, but barely beat it at the second <laughs> yeah, Glide is pretty useful. And by most, I mean all. If that's the case, we'd be happy to escort you. Really? Wow! Yeah, that it's Jaguar head boss was like pretty annoying in proud mode or expert mode if you're playing the original. But yeah, that was that was a really difficult boss fight. Alright, so, we gotta head southward from here. Alright. Level 26, level 27, yikes, don't wanna go near them. It's your favorite design boss, but my least favorite to fight, it never stops moving. Yeah, it doesn't move from its place, but it, like, shoots out a bunch of projectiles. Alright. Sacrificial reactor. I love you. Hey, Darkseon, welcome to the stream. I love you, too. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Come on, get up there. Wait. Oh yeah, I was gonna go check and see that data probe. I am going the wrong way, but I just wanna check if there's a way up. Or maybe you have to come from the, um... Oh, whatever. Hey, Wild Gek. Alright, let's just go to our destination. I'm gonna go collect some of the items around here. It has been so long. Yeah, I know. It has been like a really long time. I've been busy with college and I haven't had too much motivation with like, with you know, the streaming as well. But with Xenoblade Chronicles X out, I am going to be playing this so much. Like throughout the entire winter, I should say. Because since this game is such a massive, um, a world and lots of things to do in there, it's like... It's like, this is something I can do. Alright. Let me go collect some of the collectibles. You really can't get a Wii U for this game. You should! The only Chronicles X is gonna leave you playing for like... For a very long time. Okay, we're there. I was gonna collect the other collectibles over here, but it seems like we stopped at our destination. We'd like to place that probe just beyond here. Understood. We'll handle the fighting. I'll call you once the area is secure. Man, Elma's amazing. She's so strong and professional and beautiful. Oh my god. Hmm, <sighs> Tatsu know how friend feel. No need to shame about being ineffective and useless lump. Thanks. I just Wait, who are you calling a useless lump? <laughs> oh my god. Freaking Tatsu being so silly. Oh my god. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, there it is. Oh, we got these monsters to fight. Alright. As long as they're not too crazy difficult, I should be fine. Come on. Locked and loaded. There you go. 
I would. It's probably amazing that it's a while with Jared Peter come by these for 2016. Yeah, 2016, like, JRPGs, I don't know what JRPGs are coming, other than, like, Kingdom Hearts HD 2.8 for PS4, which I'm predicting that might come much later in, um, North America, Europe, and Australia. But I am going to play that game once that comes out. And once I get a PS4, that is. Alright, that monster is taken care of. Are you kidding me? There's so much! Alright, as long as you know the ambush isn't too crazy, she'll be fine. You're really excited for Star Ocean. I've heard about... I've heard a little bit about Star Ocean, but... I never played it, because I, I, was, I wasn't familiar with it. There we go. Let's move. Now what should who should I take care of next? I'm trying to attack them one by one. Alright, we'll just lure him over. There we go. That's taken care of. Alright, so... Oh, that's right. I can use flame grenades to get more damage while it's toppled. Alright, cool. Ow. Alright, almost there. There we go. Forfex Subduer Achievement Unlock. Sweet. Let's go. Oh, I can't use flame grenade because I used it. Oh well. Oh, it's going crazy. There we go. Oh, let's take these some collectibles. There's a lot right here. All right, sweet. Um. All right. When are you ready to attack? There we go. That's the last one we have to take care of. 